Hello, welcome back to my channel. I am Simply Brentley. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. Holy Father, angels, ancestors, speak through me. I hope I reach as many people as resonate with this message. All right, all right, all right. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, 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 like. Like I said before, when I was officially back, Again, I am officially back, so please like, 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 so we can get this channel up and, and moving and circulating, okay? So, now, this right here is for, like, I was getting what um, this person wants, did not want to tell you, or what they should have told you. Which one is it, Spirit, guys? What they should have told you, okay? So, somebody's been wanting to tell you something, and it's like they should have told you this, this, and this, and this, and that from the jump. So we're going to get more on that. Let's go ahead and clear this energy. Only welcome in good, positive energy. And we welcome in the truth. Okay? The truth. Okay. The best. Okay, so somebody sees you as the best. Somebody is definitely seeing you as a very admirable person. A, a person that is very much so a person of their word. A person that is very much so somebody. You, you, you're going to make a do with a do, baby. Somebody that can um, definitely, you're, you're a powerful manifester. You can make something out of nothing, baby. Let's go ahead and get some more information on here. Let's use the Past Life Oracle deck. Let's see what we have here. Let's adjust this so you can see. Okay. A lot of way over there. Phobias. Okay, this person was scared. They were scared to tell you. This person was scared to tell you. There's a lot of fears, and you know fear is false evidence of appearing real, but there's nothing wrong with how, being fearful of things, but you have to learn how to work through those fears. So this person, they felt like if they was going to tell you the truth, you was about to say what? Deuces, for sure. So, okay. So this person, they, they but like it, it seems like you're in separation from this person, so it ended up happening anyway. So they should have just, you know, they should have really just worked out their fears in the beginning. So this person could have definitely been sharing a living space with somebody, communal living, or they they want to have an opportunity where you can go travel and, you know, be in a communal living type of situation and get to know each other better or on a different level. We'll get some more on that, okay? What is all this? Okay. What fell on the floor was high priest or high priestess. So this person sees you as very knowledgeable. They see you as very much so a wise person. They see you as somebody that is going to follow your intuition and you're very much so spiritually guided. Okay. And we have transportation. So, okay. So I'm really getting this person wants to get out their fears. And they want to do something um, like it was some things that they need they needed to tell you, right? There were some things that they needed to tell you and they felt like, I don't know why I keep on getting mind reader, but they felt like you already knew even though they expressed it. So you might be very spiritual and they didn't feel like they needed to say some things because they, they just thought that was going to lead to some type of separation. But now we have transportation. Woo, woo. That is like, um, I got the soul train. I don't know. Okay. Anyway, so this person sees you as somebody that is very much so uh, nostalgic in their mind. They want to go ahead and uh, travel towards you. They don't care if it's a train, a plane, a, a automobile. Okay. They they definitely a uh, 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 a jet on a Pat and Sally walking. It don't even matter. This person is trying to get you back in their energy because they know they messed up in the past. They know there were some things that was holding them back, which were fears, and there were some things that they didn't tell. And then what is this that flipped over? Male, female. So it was like, uh, and they, they're not seeing eye to eye, but they're right there, right? It was it was some things like, so they could have definitely um, been in a situation with you where they weren't quite seeing eye to eye. And they're right there, very old timey thinking. So this person was very much so, they needed to update what they might. This person needed to go ahead and ascend and start their uh, ascension journey to, to do better and be better, period. Because, but guess what? This person was very immature. And we have baby here with the arms out. So it's like they need, 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 need. And keep on, like, like making excuses to why they need, always constantly need, and always constantly asking, always constantly trying to make some shit up to, for you have to, so you have to come to their rescue. And every time this person come into contact with you, what is it for? For something that they need. Okay? 
So it, it's definitely like an energy where this person was using you for something, and they they um they were using you for something in the beginning, and then they started really going into themselves, and you started teaching them some things, and then they they didn't want to like they were afraid of some shit that they started to learn, and they really got into the energy of just manipulating you, and you had to bro, cut that shit. Ain't nothing that got the oh. Uh, you had to cut that shit out because you know you better than that. And now this person is very much so like they should have told you from the jump that like, hey, because you're a type of person, you respect honesty, period. You respect honesty. They should have been very, um, like, I need some assistance with this right now. That's why I'm coming towards you and then see what had developed from that. But since they did it the other way, it's like uh, that away. You can leave it right there, baby. So they seeing your ship selling in. They're seeing you being able to heal yourself. They're seeing um, you being very spiritual and you always have been because you've taught this person something and you're doing something as you've been led to do. Biblical here. You've been doing something as you've been led to do and you've been working hard on it. Look at those ancient tools. You've been working hard on this and as you've been working hard on it, hard work is the only way you're going to get the payoff, right? The payoff and the reward that's going to be long lasting. You may get something that here um, today and gone tomorrow, but something that's long lasting is going to take hard work, right? So this person is in the energy of seeing that you get off by yourself and you don't give no fucks about what nobody else is thinking, nobody else is saying, nobody else is doing, how nobody else is feeling. You get off by yourself and you start growing, right? You might feel a little cold. You might feel a little shimmery. You might feel alone, but guess what? A lot of things come into silence. A lot of things come when you're in that period when you're alone. So now, as this person that took advantage of you is seeing you grow, seeing you doing things all by your lonesome, all by your damn self, it's like they in their mind, not even not even necessarily going to come back and approach you, but they in their mind. So whoever you thinking about right now, they in their mind thinking about you and the things that they did wrong. Some fears that they should have faced in the beginning, some lies that they told that they should have just been up front with from the damn jump, okay? Because no matter what, you're still winning. You were able to figure that shit out. It don't matter how long it took. You were able to figure it out and move the fuck on. So now you're in the energy of just very, being very vibrant. Look look at the tree of growth. If, if, and I oftentimes say, if you ain't growing, what the hell you doing? You ain't doing nothing, period. So you're oftentimes in the energy of growth. And um, you can see the light. You can see the light. And and you, you're you going to continue to work hard. And this person is going to continue to really miss you. Because you are the arts. You are very mystical and magical. You are very unique. There's nobody else like you, period. And this person sees that you are putting your trust and faith in the most high. And as you do that, it's a lot of a lot of things just shining upon you and a lot of blessings being given to you. And you know, whether that's in your love life, whether that's in like your your career, whatever it's in, you're 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 um becoming more successful. And how, if you haven't reaped any of those rewards, you soon will because you were able to just, and you're shining regardless. You are a person that like, no matter what you're going through, you're going to continue to shine. And this person is seeing that. And now they're wishing that they would have just been honest. They're wishing that they would have treated you right. They're wishing that they would have followed their intuition from the jump because best believe me, baby, they were definitely getting intuitive nudges about you. They just wasn't listening, right? So now what do we have here? Let's go ahead and put some... Talented. Now, what do we have here? We have the lovers. So, like, you're attracting a new relationship, new connections without any doubt or dilemma. Somebody that's not going to be tempted by these worldly things that we can surround ourselves with. Somebody that's really going to be for you. Somebody that's going to definitely love on you. Somebody that's going to reciprocate. Somebody that's going to, you going to know that you know that you know. Ain't no guessing games. Ain't no waiting for no uh, long periods of time to hear no text and no call back or no response. It's somebody that's going to love you for who you are and even in your flaws, right? They're going to be able to accept you for everything. We have Queen of Pentacles here. You're very down to earth. You're very practical. You're very financially responsible. This is somebody that's going to add to your life. This is not going to be anybody that you have to constantly give, 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 give to. This is somebody that's going to be equally yoked. This is somebody that's going to give to you. You're not going to even have to ask. Right. Once they see that you're in need of something or maybe you just in want of something, they're going to go ahead and throw that right out there and, OK, just throw it in the bag, period. That's the type of energy they have. And then we have the nine of cups and you deserve this, baby. Nine of cups, your wish is fulfilled. And the reason why your wishes are being fulfilled is because you were able to work on yourself and all these naysayers, all these people that were in the background 
talking shit, not doing what they said they said they was going to do, not able to face their fears because there was times and points in your life where you were scared as fuck. You were scared as fuck to move on, but guess what you did? You moved on. Guess what you did? You you packed up your shit. It don't matter if you just had the clothes on your back. It don't matter like I'm getting the teeth in your mouth. It like it, it don't matter if you didn't have anything, right? You, you were able to pick up the pieces and move the fuck on. And now it's time for your wishes to be fulfilled because you were able to stay consistent and working on yourself. So you are going to be counting your blessings and you will continue to count your blessings. And even now, if you look back in the past two years, three years ago, there is something very new in your life and there's something that's nothing but abundant and it will continue to be abundant because you're constantly working on yourself. And as you're constantly working on yourself and evolving, great new things are coming upon you in your life. Okay, baby. Now, bottom of the deck, what do we have? We have, what is that? We have the three of cups in the world, baby. We have the three of cups with a celebrating, which is victory, which is you continuing to be to this visionary that you are with the world, with completion, with success, with fulfillment, with high attainment, with you acknowledging who you are and just continuing just to put your effort in and continuing to get those rewards. Okay. All right. All right, this is absolutely wonderful. Yes, best believe this person is watching. Best believe this person is wishing that they could have told you what it should have, could have, what have, whatever. But you're on to the uh, your your true north node and following exactly what you are led to do. All right, don't forget to get your energy in. This is absolutely amazing. They wish they should have told you, but it looked like it's too late. All right, it's too late for all that because you moved on and you're doing better. I'm moving on. Oh, moving on. All right, all right, all right. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. As always, peace, love, and namaste.